Hey everyone, today is July 30th, 2019, and I hope all of you have been a great day today. And I decided I'm going to start this video tonight and finish it tomorrow. As you can see on my BRZ, my nurse spec style wing is not on the car anymore. And that's because I'm getting a new spoiler for the car, and I'm actually getting it tonight. So one of my 86 group is driving from Wisconsin. They'll be here within the next hour or so, and I'll be getting a new spoiler for my car. And it's something that I liked for a while, something I already had actually. And I think it's a good change for my car. I do love the nurse spec wing. It was good for the time I had it, but I am ready for something new. So I'll pick up this video when they get here. Obviously it's getting dark outside. It'll most likely be completely dark when they get here. So I'll either see you guys later tonight or tomorrow morning. Hope you guys enjoy this video and let's get to it. So I just got out of work and I started this video last night and as you can see I don't have my nurse spec wing on my BRZ anymore. So I had the nurse spec wing for about six months or so and I did love it but I wanted to go back to a ducktail or duckbill spoiler and I ended up going back with a carbon fiber one. And I really just wanted a change for the car and I think it does look really sleek. And what I like about it is, I do have the carbon fiber duckbill spoiler. I do have carbon fiber tail lights, if you can see that right there. And my carbon fiber overlay right there. And it's really hard to see with the camera because it's really bright outside right now. But it does look awesome with the carbon fiber on the tail lights, the wing, and that right there. And the only thing I'm missing from behind right here is a carbon fiber rear diffuser. Just imagine if that was carbon fiber. This, the back end of my car would look awesome. And I'm rethinking a bunch of things for the car right now. Like, like my side skirts right here. I was going to get rid of these, my carbon fiber side skirts. But I think I'm going to keep them now because I have the carbon fiber wing again. And I might go with carbon fiber everything. And I think I'm going to go with the carbon fiber mirrors as well. And I may get a new front lip, a carbon fiber lip, but we'll see. Um, I still have a few things I have to check out, some new modifications for the car, but I'm ready to change a lot of things. And when I get back to my house, I'm going to see if I'm going to put on my winglets I had on. A lot of you guys did notice my last video, I did take off my winglets I had on here, and I took them off just to see how I would look. And I like them with or without it, but when I get home, I'll put them on, I'll let you guys choose if I should keep them on the car or take them off. So I'm going to start heading home right now and we'll get this cold start going. Oh, and one last thing, and imagine if these canards were carbon fiber too. Uh, those TRD canards are really nice, but if they were carbon fiber, it would match my theme I'm going with right now. I even have my carbon fiber steering wheel by Speed by Design, and my car is so loud now with my aftermarket front pipe and the overpipe. Sounds so good. I really do love the new setup I have on my BRZ. So I've had this exhaust set up for less than a week and I am honestly in love with it. It is so loud right now, but it's perfect. It's hard to get it on camera like I said in my previous video. The camera can't catch the tone of the exhaust well, but it does have a deep rumble to it, and you have that unequal length header sound to it, that rumble, that Subaru rumble that sounds great. And I am really happy with it. I'll keep you guys updated as the weeks go by. It's been less than a week. I'm still in the honeymoon phase for my new exhaust setup, but we'll see how it goes. Pop 
cops are now so loud for my car. And now I know my exhaust is spitting flames, which is awesome. And a lot of you guys requested in my previous video that I do a night drive, put a GoPro over the exhaust so I can film some of those flames coming out of my exhaust pipe. All right, we'll get a quick acceleration. And it's hard to do this with one hand, but it's okay. Just got home and you could smell the catalyst exhaust from here and yeah so this was the new wing I got went back to a carbon fiber ducktail wing the sun's kind of going down so you can see it better here and it has a really nice carbon weave on here and yeah I did like the nurse spec wing don't get me wrong the nurse spec wing looked awesome looked really aggressive and I did enjoy it when I had it and I got a lot of compliments and you don't see many people or at least in the Chicago area that have a nurse spec wing and everyone and their mom has a carbon fiber or just a paint match ducktail wing but for me it just looks more subtle to me more subtle and the car looks nice and I don't know the nurse spec wing is aggressive I like it but for me the ducktail wing for the BRZ FRS in 86 for me it looks a lot more a lot more sleek and like I told you, I'm going to do a lot more things to the car, like I said. A lot of big plans coming soon. And I really do want to get a carbon fiber lip. And I want to get a whole Japanese lip kit, if that makes sense. So like a rare lip kit that not many people have that matches, looks really sleek all the way around. And that's what I'm planning to do. And the one thing I'm always going to keep with this car is my work emotion wheels. Like I said in many videos, these have been my dream wheels for the longest time. They're still in great condition. All right guys, so please leave a comment down below what you guys like better. If you guys like the nurse spec wing better or just a simple carbon fiber duckbill wing. Very subtle, but very sleek. I wanna get your guys' opinion. I mean, I like both. I can always go back to a nurse spec later on. But for now, I'm back with the carbon fiber ducktail wing. And really quick, I want to get your opinion on these as well. So I recently took these canard winglets off my car just to see how it would look. And I do like how it looks stock. And if I put this on here, it's good enough. Tell me if you guys like this better. I'll take a step back here. Should I put the winglets back on the car? Or should I stick with no winglets and stay stock? I'm definitely getting back in the groove of filming. And for the last maybe six months or so, I haven't been posting at all. And I've been really motivated lately to pick up the camera, do things with the car, film car shows and so on. And I'm excited to film videos for all of you.